तेरा कीता मीठा लागे वट एवर यू डू सो नानक की सेंग वट एवर यू डू इज स्वीट हैज नेक्टर टू मी ही सेंग इट टू द एग्जिस्टेंस टू द लॉर्ड टू द गॉड टू द डिविनिटी टू द नेचर हाउ सो एवर वी वॉन्ट टू से दैट बट ही सेंग टू दैट एटरनल एटरनलनेस तेरा कीता मीठा लागे वट एवर यू डू आई एम इन एब्सोल्यूट एक्सेप्टेंस आई एम इन एब्सोल्यूट ट्रस्ट वट एवर यू डू इज स्वीट टू मी समाइम इट फील्स बेटर टू मी बिकॉज आई एम नॉट एबल टू सी थ्रू दैट्स नॉनक इज नॉट सेंग दैट यू नो दिस इज दिस पर्सन सेंग दैट इन लाइफ मेनी टाइम्स यू नॉट एबल टू एक्सेप्ट थिंग्स ट्रस्ट ऑन थिंग्स विच आर हैपनिंग the events the experiences become bitter to us not to nanak nanak says i have deep trust deep acceptance deep trust in everything that happens in this life i have deep trust in life itself whatever happens here happens for the good in your raza with your command it happens how can i reject it look at another sutra here another profound meaning here in life in our own experience we live as duality two beings i and you duality the sense of duality is is very strong in us that's how we operate relate in the world when i live life in this sense of duality everything is a struggle i'm fighting with every phenomena i have a certain personal individual will and then existence has its own will <laughs> and these two wills fight with each other the existential will the river is flowing but i want to go the other way I do not want to flow with the flow of the river I want to go the opposite way hence the struggle my will is conflicting with the will of god with the existential will hence the pain hence the suffering hence the struggle because i do not trust in the existential ways because i think i am the one who is governing this life is it so i met a friend this morning and a certain dialogue was happening and i just asked who digests the food that you eat she says it happens on its own i said who breathes the air and keeps you alive do you do that she says no it happens on its own who's doing that can you not see the will here of the existence can you not trust in this will of existence but since we live in the world in the experience of duality we create our own will when we create our own will the will of existence is not acceptable to us we do not trust the will of the existence hence the conflict hence the suffering but look at the way of the enlightened being look at the way of nanak for nanak there is no individual personal will the will of existence the will of god the will of nature is his will hence he is able to say tera kita meetha lage whatever you do is sweet nectar to me because i am in absolute acceptance because i am in absolute trust no conflict i am flowing with this flow of life i am not trying to flow the opposite direction i am in absolute agreement whatever happens i know it must be plan of for certain it must be based on a certain blueprint which maybe i am not able to see right now huh? but i am in absolute agreement with this blueprint no struggle hmm? nanak 
In the second light, Nanak Sahib says, Har naam padarath Nanak mange. That still sometime Nanak too has a wish. <laughs> what does Nanak wish for? Nanak wish for the remembrance, the, the treasure of remembrance of this truth. That may I always remember this absolute truth. That your will is the supreme will. I do not have any individual will. I do not want to have any struggle, any conflict with the existential will of the whole. With the existential will of this life. May I be in absolute remembrance. Give me this treasure. Give me this treasure that I remember this 24 hours a day. When I'm eating food, I remember this. It's your will. It's your grace. When I'm breathing with each breath, I remember this. It's your will. It's your grace. When my body is sick, I remember this. It's your will. It's your grace. No struggle. This is the only wish Nanak asks for. That give me this gift, this blessing, this treasure of this remembrance. Look at our own lives now. What is our wish? Even when we go to temple, Gurudwara, church, wherever we go, even if we sit in silence and pray to to some being, what is our wish? What are we asking for? What are we praying for? Thousands of things. Are we really praying that may please bless me with this remembrance alone? Nothing else is needed to survive. Everything else that is needed to survive is already taken care of. Give me this gift, this blessing of remembrance. Do we say that? Is that our prayer? Is that our wish? Is that our desire? Is the question. Mm -hmm.